Hey you guys, good morning. Let me try to fix y'all some, can y'all see me? As if y'all can talk back, but I just finished getting ready. I am, got a lot to do today actually. I'm gonna use some baby oil. My hands are so ashy. I had to dry my hands, wash my hands so good because I put some product in my hair. And I hate the way my, that product like feels all over my hands. But anyways, I'm rambling already. <laughs> today, we have a lot to do. Well, not a lot, but we have things to do. So today is the day I'm officially becoming a Georgia resident. I don't know how I feel about that. I feel like it happened too soon. I plan on doing like, you know, staying a Floridian for as long as I can. But y'all know I told my car, I had to get another car. And um, for them to send me my real tag, I have to send them my driver's license, my Georgia's license. So that's the first thing we're going to do. We're going to go um, do that. I'm going to bring all types of documents because I need to get this done today. So I'll bring my passport, my social security card, my birth certificate, um, my old license. Let me put this in my purse right now. And then I'm also going to bring two like pieces of mail with my address on it. So I should definitely have everything. After that, I want to get my nails done. Dion and I's anniversary is tomorrow. And I want to get my nails done. You know, he might he might he might propose. <laughs> and if he proposed to me with my nails like this. It's going to be a problem. I'm just playing. He better not propose. Oh my God. What if he propose? He not going to propose. He better not. Anyways. <laughs> um, want to get my nails done. I also want to stop by Bath and Body Works today. Because they are having a sale on their like, car fresheners. The little things are $1.50. So I want to pick up a few of those. And then I also have to go to a hair store for Dion to get like some duck clips and I guess some retwisting gel or something because he's getting his hair done. So yeah, child, we busy. We are busy today. Busy beavers. My these big Chanel earrings are itching my ears, and I'm kind of like sensitive to um costume jewelry, but I haven't experienced this in a while. I'm trying to oh it itch so bad. I want to know if it's because makeup is on my ears and I can't find any type of makeup wipe to like wipe my ears down, put the earrings back in. It's 11 o'clock on the dot and we need to head out. I just got on a real simple outfit. I love this shirt. I got on some ripped jeans and then the shoes that I showed y'all in yesterday's vlog. Those slides I found at Nordstrom Rex. So fucking cute. But yeah, that's everything. That's everything. I'm just making sure I got everything. I did the lotion my feet and then I guess I'll see you guys in the car. Alright, so we made it in the car. My freaking stomach is killing me, y'all. Uh, I woke up this morning to Shark Week. And I'm just trying to figure out <laughs> my anniversary is tomorrow. My man's birthday is Sunday. Okay. I see how you want to play it. Yeah, it's cool. So, I don't think I stay by a DMV. I'm just... No, 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 no. 14 miles? There's no fucking way. Oh, well, 14 miles is only 26 minutes. That's not that bad. Um, I just want to make sure. Is this the same one from Google? Yeah. This is my first time in my whole existence going to the DMV with makeup on. I have never been to the DMV with makeup on and to think that I'm taking a picture. I'm excited to see um how it comes out, but I'm kind of disappointed because 
I think Georgia licenses are in black and white, and I just feel like. But yeah, y'all, my mouth is probably shaped weird because I just put my Invisalign back in for the day, so we're dealing with that. Somebody just commented on this girl live and said, "Is it true you're dating a married man?" People are so fucking annoying. <laughs> this girl is not dating no married man, but I've been watching her live all morning. I just feel so good today. Today is just a good day. It's going to be a good day. I'm just in a great mood. My spirits are high. I am just so happy because every day is not a good day around here between Norman and the Western. <laughs> every day ain't no good day for me and i've been going through a lot mentally and in my personal life and it's just sometimes overwhelming overwhelming especially when i don't really have anyone to talk to you know about it or i don't i rather not talk about it because that's just how I am sometimes. But it's just a lot sometimes. But today is a good day. I feel really good. I feel so blessed. I feel loved. I just feel good. I just I just feel so good. And I just love days when I feel good. You know? I'm happy. I am. I'm happy and I'm blessed. And I'm just happy. And when I was walking to my car today, this morning, a couple minutes ago, I was just like, wow, man. Like... I know I was being like a little bratty because, you know, just how the situation played out, but everybody's not able to just wake up one morning and just go get a car, you know? So I'm just so blessed and I'll never take that for granted ever. <sighs> I was just talking to God and I was telling him like, I'm sorry for how I was acting because, you know, but I'm human, it happens. But I'm just so happy y'all. I hope y'all are having a great day because I sure am. And knowing that I'm having a great day, I know that the devil is gonna to try to come in sometime during this day and intervene, but it's not happening. I already claimed my good day, so. Yeah, y'all, back to my music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Y'all, it's official. I am a Georgia resident. Oh, so bittersweet. But y'all, I'm pissed off because, first of all, I have to keep this piece of paper. This is my ID until I guess it comes in the mail. And Florida, well, Jacksonville, we don't do it like that. You get your ID the same day. But anyways, I just feel like that lady was really hating on me because, ma'am, you could have told me all of my chins were showing. I, I don't even want to show y'all this. This is a real wake up call because I don't like that. Y'all, dead ass. This is not like, girl. I really felt like that picture had potential, but mm -mm, no ma'am. Another. She must have zoomed in so close because I don't see. Girl. Anyway. Anyway, anyway. How many? How many? <laughs> All right. So, what are we doing now? What are we doing? What are we doing? I, I'm making a TikTok, so I'm finna put it on. Uh, I gotta tell Dion 107.9. That's the lit radio station. My baby been looking for a, a good radio station. Let me put y'all on my TikTok. Alright. Let's see.
All right. Where to? What else is that we have to do, y'all? I'm hungry. I'm hungry. That's for sure. And y'all, I am. I'm bloated. Like. I, I, I am, for real, because I, this is embarrassing. I haven't ate nothing all morning, and I mean, granted, I'm a big girl. I always got a stomach, but no, she she's protruding today. I mean, who, I have to be a psychopath. I have to be a psychopath, because who do you know is in a good mood like this on day one of the period? Yeah, I'm for sure a psychopath. It's proven. You know what I want to eat? I want some barbecue. Food near me. Food near me. Food near me. Let's see what we got. I could do sushi too. Oh my God, am I near a Popeyes? <laughs> we going to Popeyes. Oh my God, I never told y'all about this. So one night me and Dion went to um, Wendy's and ordered my food, told them exactly what I wanted, barbecue sauce. That's all I get from Wendy's. The shit is amazing. So, um, told them I wanted barbecue sauce, placed my order, get to the front. She like, we ain't got no barbecue sauce. So I said, I don't want this food. Can I get a refund? And so she was like, huh? I was like, yeah, can I get a refund? And so her manager comes up and she's like, you got to be kidding me, right? And I was like, no, I want a refund. Like, and that was that. And so um, probably like a week or two later, we went to that same Wendy's. And um, before I even ordered, I was like, do you all have barbecue sauce? And it was, a, it was like, um... The girl working the window, you know, I was talking to her, taking my order, and I hear the lady come on through the headset and say, yes, we have barbecue sauce. And I'm thinking like, all right, bitch, watch it. So, yeah, when I go to um, Popeye's, I'm going to say, do y'all have Black and Ranch? Because if you don't have no Black and Ranch, I don't want it. Hello. I'm going to take your order, please. Hello, um, I would like, I have a coupon from the app. It's the Two Can Dine Signature, $8.99. Two sides, five pieces of chicken. That's a mild. Mild. What's the side? Um, can I get mashed potatoes with extra gravy? Yeah. And can I get black and ranch, please? I may not be charged. That's fine. Can I get three? Anything else? That'll be all. Hey, your coupon on the phone, um... Take it down when you get to the window, please. Okay, thank you. Guys, we have secured the sauce. I don't care how much it costs. That's not what I asked. So, other than me having to eat my mashed potatoes with my chicken bone, I would rate this Popeye's experience a 9 out of 10. I really enjoyed my food. And it had black and ranch, so. I feel like this area that I'm in, a hair store would be around here. So we are about to look up a beauty supply so I can get the stuff for Dion to get his hair done with. And it's literally right here. I told you, I just, I can feel when there's a hair store in the area. Child, apparently I'm at some type of mall, the Mall West, some shit. Look a little sketchy, they got security outside. <sighs> so let's go in, child. Let's go in. Whew. All right, y'all. That mall was giving very much ghetto. It is what it is. But I got what I needed, so I'm very thankful for that mall. It reminds me of a of a Regency. Actually, to be quite honest, it's better than a Regency because they actually have stores there. They girl, they got a whole damn city trance in there. They got a city trance. They got like a you know like those stores that just sell stuff like it might be called like New York fashion or they had one called like Sassies. They just sell all types of just stuff. And now we are headed to Atlantic Station. All right, I don't know what I want my car to smell like. I know I'm gonna get an endless weekend because I really like endless weekend. One in Chris Bear. That smell like. Mmm. I like that. That smells really. Oops. This smells good too. Um. What else, y'all? What else? What else? What else? Let me smell pumpkin cupcake. Mm mm. Too sweet. Ocean probably smell like a man. Mm hmm. Smells good. Um. 
pumpkin pecan waffles. This is, that's too sweet for the car. Yeah, I am tired. My makeup getting oily. <sighs> the hell are you looking at? All right, but I got my little car thingies. I bought two of these for the actual scent to come out of. Bath and Body Works car plugs do not work. I ended up taking them back. I wasted my money. I'm going to use the um the morning air, crisp morning air. <laughs> All right, so let's see. How do you do these? You lift that up? Okay. Mm. These kind of smell like a little manly, but I like it. And then you open this right here. Put that in there. And close the back. So I'm gonna put one over here. All right. I'm only gonna put one in here. I was gonna do two, but I already got like a little Febreze thing I bought the other day. So let's see how those work together. And of course y'all know, I'm with the h and I'll show y'all what I get, when I what I got when I get home. I'm tired, y'all. Last place I gotta go is um to the nail salon. I really don't feel like doing that, but I'm gonna go ahead and go. I'm gonna just see if they can cut my nails all the way down. Just give me a feeling and paint them white. Real simple. Yes to plan. Stomach's starting to hurt, so it's about time for me to dip. Alright, y'all. So I am finally out of the nail salon. I would rate my experience a 8 out of 10. I went to just a random nail salon. Nothing bougie, nothing spectacular. Literally a regular nail salon. And I just didn't feel like, sometimes you don't be feeling like all that. And I just ain't feel like what all the other salons be having going on. But they had me waiting forever. That's the, that's why I get them an 8 out of 10. Other than that, she took her time. I absolutely love my nails. I didn't do white. I thought I was doing a milky pink. However, this is not milky pink. But I'm obsessed, y'all. I love, 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 love this color. I don't know if y'all can tell, but it looks kind of new. It's like a really light nude color. It's called 452, I think, Sweet Romance, if you're interested. But I really, really like it. I think it's really cute. And she shaped my nails just how I like them, really square. Got them cut down really short. And I'm in love. They're perfect. So I'm getting ready to head home because Dion is finna get his hair done. And I got the hair equipment. <laughs> the hair equipment. The hair stuff with me and the person she's coming to us. So, um, yeah, I need to get back home. So I'm gonna get back home. Oh, and then I guess I'll show y'all what I got from H&M once we get home. Finally home, y'all. Your girl is tired. Like, y'all know we have been going all back up. So y'all always be all up in my face. But y'all know we've been going all day. All day long. Like, I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. I still have to go back out, but Dion said he wanna he gonna ride with me. We wanna go to Walmart because I need to get some mouthwash. So we'll do that like later once he gets his hair done and everything. But I guess I'll show y'all what I got from H&M. This is the stuff from the hair store. Um, I just got some black dye. And then I think I showed y'all this. I don't know, but. The bond stuff people be using. And then I got the duck clips for Dion. And then I got this lock firm wax by Mango and Lime. So yeah. So from H&M, I got a pair of cream sweats, which I had a pair last year. But uh, 
And then, you know what? I should have got the extra large because these, I'm probably going to end up taking these back. I got to see how they fit, but they're these cream color. I had the extra, extra large last year, and I just felt like I looked a little sloppy in them. Y'all know, if you don't know, H&M stuff runs big, so got those. I got this sweater. It's like a, um, let me show you. It has like the chunky neck on it, like the real chunky neck, and it has no sleeves. And it's kind of long too. Like, this is a prime example. This is an XL. This is gonna be so fucking cute, bro. Ugh, I can't even. Like, I hope y'all ready for these fall looks, cause they're coming. And then the last thing I got was this black baby doll. Well, no, I got one more thing. If you know me, you know I love baby doll dresses. I don't care. A lot of people don't like them, but I'm obsessed. I hope this looks good on me, though, because sometimes I can just look like a whale. So I got to try this on, but I love this. Like with some, see, y'all can't see it. Y'all can't, y'all really can't see like what it's giving right now, but it's really cute. I just hope it looks good on me. The last thing I had got was this Bottega Green case. I'm just obsessed with this color right now. And when I seen this, I had to get it. It was only $6 and I needed a new case because this was a clear case and y'all, it's brown now. Like, how does clear turn brown? I don't know, but I got a new case. And it is so cute. Oh, and it's so sleek. It just feels so good. I'm obsessed. I love this. So, yeah, I think that's everything. I think I've showed you guys everything. I'm about to just relax because I'm tired. Truth is, I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. So, oh, the nails, y'all. This color, like, it's not, you can't really see it because it kind of look white, but it's not white. It's like a milky cream color. It's really cute. But I'm rambling now. I'll be back, maybe. Y'all, let me show y'all the dress. Hopefully, you can, like, really see it, but it's so cute. It's just like a, like a baby doll dress. Oh, uh, with combat boots, a look. Yeah, let me know what y'all think about this. I love the oversized turtleneck, but do I need it? Necessary, it has no sleeves, but I love this part. Let me know what y'all think. Disregard what I said about these um, leg jeggings, sweatpants I got on, these are not the same ones. This is kind of cute though. Like, you know. I think this is kind of cute. And then, yeah, I know my Balenciagas are this color, so I could do like the Balenciagas. It could be like a streetwear. I think this is cute. What y'all think?